A person's vision is the most important way in which he or she experiences the world. Neovascular age-related macular degeneration, or AMD, accounts for less than 10% of all AMD cases, but causes about 90% of all AMD-related cases of legal blindness. Neovascular AMD can progress quickly, with vision declining to legal blindness in as little as two years. Existing therapies for neovascular AMD have been shown in clinical trials to slow vision loss, but they have not been shown to consistently increase vision above pretreatment baseline levels. Is it possible to improve this picture? Is it possible to see an improvement in vision and in everyday activities as measured by visual function? Is it possible for patients to gain vision? The pathophysiology of neovascular AMD may provide a clue. Let's take a closer look at a healthy eye before the onset of neovascular AMD. As we move through the eye, past the retina, notice the optic disc, macula, and fovea. We see that this is a healthy retina. In contrast, neovascular AMD is characterized by angiogenesis, the localized proliferation of abnormal vessel growth and highly permeable choroidal vessels which can penetrate Brooks' membrane. This results in damage to photoreceptors on the retinal pigment epithelium, also known as RPE, and other retinal cell layers that ultimately leads to central vision loss. The normal expression of vascular endothelial growth factor, or VEGF, is essential to many processes in the body, including wound healing, and is a helpful adaptation to ischemia. There are several types of growth factors, VEGF A, B, C, D, and E, and placenta growth factor. VEGF A is a primary factor responsible for the development of choroidal neovascularization in neovascular AMD in in vitro studies. There are several biologically active isoforms of VEGF A that differ by amino acid length. VEGF A 189, 121, 165, 206, and the cleavage product VEGF A 110. All of these soluble isoforms have the same effect, promotion of new vessel growth and vascular leakage. When any of these isoforms bind to their receptors on nearby choroidal blood vessels, highly permeable new blood vessels grow into the subretinal space, causing edema and leading to deterioration of vision. Is it possible for this current landscape to be redefined? Introducing Lucentis the first treatment proven to help patients with neovascular AMD gain and sustain vision. Patient benefits start with maintaining vision with Lucentis. 90% of patients with minimally classic or occult lesions treated with Lucentis maintain vision at two years, and 96% of patients with predominantly classic lesions treated with Lucentis maintain vision at one year. Patients can also gain vision with Lucentis. 70% of patients with minimally classic or occult lesions treated with Lucentis gain greater than or equal to zero letters of vision at two years. And 78% of patients with predominantly classic lesions treated with Lucentis gain greater than or equal to zero letters of vision at one year. In fact, Lucentis results in a rapid and sustained gain in vision at years one and two. With Lucentis, every line of vision gained translates into real-life benefits for patients. Lucentis is proven to help restore patients' independence so that they are better able to perform everyday activities such as shopping or reading. Every line of vision gained is a piece of life restored. Lucentis is specifically designed and approved for intraocular use. Lucentis is a unique monoclonal antibody fragment designed with a smaller size relative to a whole antibody, allowing it to penetrate all retinal layers to reach the site of choroidal neovascularization. Lucentis exclusively binds to all active isoforms of VEGF A with high affinity. Lucentis is the first anti-angiogenic treatment proven to inhibit all active isoforms of VEGF A, preventing their interaction with VEGF receptors on endothelial cells. This reduces the overstimulus of the angiogenic pathway, reducing macular edema, preventing lesion growth and vascular leakage, and normalizing retinal structure. 
The unique design of Lucentis helps patients gain and sustain vision. As an antibody fragment, Lucentis is rapidly eliminated systemically by targeting the development of choroidal neovascularization and by blocking all known active isoforms of VEGF-A and their cleavage products, Lucentis can safely help patients with neovascular AMD gain and sustain vision. It's an improvement in vision that your patients will see for themselves. Lucentis. Improving vision. Restoring hope.